find working with cobblestone learning as well, I suppose? Um, we loved it. Um, you know, it, it wouldn't have been possible without Sarah as a project manager um, for all of the reasons I've just moaned to you about. Um, but um, we've just been so happy with the design and consultation process, with the, you know, the acting on feedback, the, um, the creativity, like, I mean, <laughs> we don't know how to do this stuff. And, and, and you have the, the ideas that were presented, the way that feedback was solicited and acted upon, um, we just have been really delighted um, throughout the process with what you came up with. And um, again, that's evidence in the fact that the project we thought was going to be one tiny little pocket um, and the work was just so good and effective that it grew way beyond the scope of the initial um, plan. Um, so yeah, it's been great. <laughs> One thing that was really stood out from the very beginning um, in the tender process even, um, your materials were just miles ahead in terms of readability, in terms of thoroughness. Um, of addressing the RFQ. Um, so that was incredibly useful. One, it made our decision very easy, and two, it just gave a very clear picture of what to expect from the beginning. Um, and I think it was really useful having um, Mark and Rachel as two sort of constant uh, points of contact um, who we were in touch with quite regularly. Um, and I don't know if we were like excessively demanding, but we did get a lot of their time, um, which was really helpful. Um, and again, their their responsiveness um, was was really useful. And I do I know Sarah spent a lot of time sort of, you know, chasing everything up and making sure it was all in place mm -hmm. at the time and everything. Um, but it, it was in fact um, at the end of the day. So that was great. We've absolutely loved working with with you guys, and that is the way to do it effectively, right? Is to hire an expert um, and and do that. So, I know there'll be a launch, and and these things, you know, ultimate results kind of come over time. Yeah. Um, but I suppose at this point, what results or benefits have you seen so far from from the project? Um. Well, the results obviously are the products that we've seen. Um, so we've got student testimonial videos, we've got animations, we've got screencasts, we've got quizzes, um, we've got um, pieces of text, we've got links to all sorts of resources, we've got I opened the spreadsheet yesterday to count the number of resources and I don't remember what the very large number was. Um, and so we've got all these really tangible pieces. Um, by the end of August, beginning of September, those will be slotted into two Brightspace modules. Um, and those two modules will be, you know, the ultimate tangible outcome of the project. <laughs>